Hello friends, welcome to LMS Solution Research Support. In this video, we are going to discuss about how to convert an image into a uh, text that is a paragraph. So, uh, if you are doing a research, uh, you have to search for different pictures. For example, say if you are searching for a flowchart, um, you are seeing a, a flowchart related with your work. So in order to convert that flowchart uh, picture into a theoretical content, so you are in need to uh, study that flowchart. So after understanding the flowchart, you have to download the paper where the flowchart is and you have to uh, go through that uh, paper. So and you have to make a notes of it about that flowchart. So by seeing image itself, you can convert your uh, uh, image that is your uh, flowchart image into a text. So thereby you can use that uh, paragraph in for your literature review. So especially for literature survey, we, are, we have to search for different types of papers. So and, we'll, and you will find some diagrams or pictures or any flowcharts related with that particular uh, topic. So thereby that images can be converted into your text form that is into a paragraph content. So let us see and explore how this uh, image can be converted into text using our chat GPT. So let us go on to today's video. So I am going to search different flow charts of MPPT algorithms. So after clicking, just click on images, you will get the different types of images of the different flowcharts. So if, if for example, just I am clicking this flowchart. So uh, this flowchart, uh, hope you will understand, uh, someone can understand by seeing the image itself or you have to go for this paper and you have to study that paper and then understand. So here what I, I am going to do is, I am just going to uh, convert the text uh, that is the algorithm that is flowchart image into an algorithm. So just I am clicking. So you can copy the link address. So after copying the link address, open your chat GPT. So in the chat GPT, click paste. So here give explain in detail about the above flowchart. So I am clicking in chat GPT. Just so explain in detail about the above flowchart. So I am going to click. So here you can see the flowchart so shows the functioning of an part up and observe maximum power point tracking algorithm for photo systems so like that uh, it will generate a detailed explanation of that particular flowchart so you can see uh, how it will does here you can see the algorithm then compares the current power so a detailed explanation of that particular flowchart is given and you can use this uh, content for your survey purpose so you can make a notes of it or you can copy the points important pinpointed points whatever you want from this particular content and you can make use of this also so let us see another different types of flowchart so you are just to click on so you are you, here you can see different mppt algorithm flowchart Now I am going to click a block diagram here, a random block diagram. So here I am going to copy the link address, go to chat GPT, copy the link address, explain the above block diagram in detail. So you can see uh, here uh, it's a random block diagram where you can find PV array, power converter and a load. So a PWM generator and MPPT algorithm with duty cycle adjustment. So voltage and current sensing. 
so these are the components which is available in this block diagram so let us see how chat gpt can convert this uh, block diagram into a theoretical content with the detailed explanation so you can see here so the block diagram shows the basic architecture of a solar pv system and maximum power point tracking uh, so like that it will detail explain in detail so for every block is explained here the solar pv it is a basic uh, thing that is it comprises of a solar battery and a load solar panel converts so like that the basic steps here you can see the MPPT configuration uses DC to DC converter to match the impedance of solar panel with that of load so like that uh, it will explain explanation of that particular block diagram in detail so if you go on through a particular block diagram or a flow chart or whatever the pictures it may be if you want to make that picture into a theoretical content so you can use this idea of for, con for this conversion so thereby you can make uh, theoretical content without in less time without uh, studying a different uh, papers for a long time so if you are struggling to make a notes of a particular uh, picture so you can use this method so uh, this is another important option so here i am using a version of chat gpt3 so you can upgrade to chat gpt plus and then you can access gpt4 also so uh, in gpt4 this the same content can be explained by a human like thinking content so this content is enough for our literature literature survey process so in order to uh, analyze it, it it in very analytically if you want to analyze for example it comprises of an equation or something else which can which a human can think like that you can use for your gpt4 also so by upgrade your plus plan so this is the uh, important thing here so you can make use of this idea to convert your image into a particular paragraph that is a text content and you can use that for your literature survey purpose to create your research paper very finely so thank you for watching our videos hope this video will be very helpful for you have a nice day thank you